What's going on, fam? It's the entertainer, motivator, the educator, Lucky Murray, back with another Gamecock news update. Today, we're speaking about South Carolina road to winning the SEC East has to go through three schools. That is Tennessee, that is Kentucky, and that's Missouri. But before I go any further, man, here's what I need you to do. One of three things. Join the Patreon. Yes, if you love exclusive content here, if you want to support the channel, that's the best way to do it. So go to patreon.com forward slash Lucky Murray. Link will be in the description below. Two, you need to buy the merch. Yes, it'll be exclusive merch that comes up there. The link will be in the description below. You can't do that. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell. The like no every time I drop a video. Three, share the video. Have a time. Let's get into this, man. But it's a topical video today. I was watching, listening, not watching, but I was listening to 107.5 The Game. Shout out to them guys, man. I've been listening to 107.5 The Game since August of 2007. Uh, that was when they first uh, came to the capital city. I was in Columbia at the time, and I was like, oh, a, flat, a sports talk? I didn't know they had sports talk in Columbia. And I remember riding my bike, and then back, back then, I don't know if you guys remember, but my I had a flip phone, but it had a little FM uh, receiver <laughs> that you could plug in your, your headphones and you could listen to the radio. I'd be riding my bike listening to 107.5 The Game, and I was, man, faithfully listening to them until I moved away and I came to the upstate. But now, due to um, satellite radio, or the TuneIn app, I can listen to it anywhere. So I listened to the host. I think it was Heath Klein, I believe. And he was speaking about how South Carolina needed – to, to win these three crucial games that we lost last year in order to take the next step. Um, we could beat Georgia, but if we want to compete in that that that, that tier after Georgia and may have a shot uh, at really doing some great things in the SEC, we need to win three games. He said it was Tennessee, Kentucky, and Missouri. Those are three games that we lost last year that we need in order to take that next step. So we're going to look at the schedule last year, and we're going to go from there. Man, so listen right here. So if you look at this game right here, the first game comes up, Kentucky, 10-16. That's the game I felt like we should we should have won. I think offensively we was a little sluggish with that. But we, uh, playing Kentucky, man, we need that win against Kentucky. Mark Stoops and those Wildcats have had our number for the past five or six years. Yes, the streak at Clemson has been crazy, but this Kentucky streak has been even crazier, man. I remember us dominating Kentucky, but Kentucky over the course of these uh, last few years – have really been playing good football. So that's a game we need to win. Two, Tennessee. That game, we really look like doo-doo out there. If y'all remember correctly, that was a game I was like, oh, I don't think we're going to win seven games. Matter of fact, I think we're going to win like four or five. I was really weary, weary after the 20-45 to 45 shellacking in Knoxville, Tennessee. But that game's at home as well. I, I think that that's, that would be a diff, different game. And this Kentucky game is in Kentucky, so that's, that's going to be a tough game. This next game right here, Missouri. This was in Columbia, Missouri. Uh, that's a tough game. We need to get the W. We need to get the dub because here's the thing, and this is the thing I said uh, last year. That was a game we needed to get that seven wins. Now, we, we upset it Auburn to get to that seven win, but let's say we beat Missouri after beating Florida. So, Florida – Missouri, Auburn. That's eight wins right there with the bowl win. No, no, no. no. That, 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 that's seven wins, eight wins with the bowl. That's a really good season. So those, let's say we won those three games right there. Instead of going seven to six, we would have went. Uh, we would probably won ten games. That 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 three swing right there. We need those those wins in order to take that the next uh level. So we go look at this this schedule right here. Let's go to the 2022 schedule right there. Um, as y'all can see, we got Georgia State coming up. Uh, so so if you think about this, right? So we got Kentucky coming up after the SC State win. So the, here's what I think with this Kentucky win right there. I think we would know what our team looks like after that that Kentucky game because we got South Carolina, we got Charlotte. We're gonna play a tough game against Georgia and Arkansas, and then we got Georgia State. So by that Kentucky game, we should know what. What we are as a team. Texas A&M uh, uh, game is going to be hard. Homecoming, Missouri. I think that this game right here is a must win right here. Right? If you think about this, if we beat Kentucky, we're probably going to lose against Texas A&M. Who knows? We may have won. But that's a trap game waiting to happen. Uh, Missouri Tigers feel like they can beat us, but I think that we can beat Missouri as well. Um, and it's in Columbia, South Carolina, homecoming. 
And then we got Tennessee, baby. I believe right here, man, this game we have to win because that's going to be the momentum game that's going to get us to Clemson. Even though this Clemson game is in Clemson, South Carolina. But still, baby, I, I think that, man, listen, think about this. Let's say we, we're eight wins going into that, that Tennessee game. <laughs> Do you know how crazy Willie B would be when it comes to that? But here's what I'm going to say to you, man. Here's what I'm going to say to you guys. I'm going to say here. So, excuse me for the, uh, it's not, sorry, guys, it, the, the, the camera quality. I'm going to keep rocking, right? I'm going to keep rocking. Let's go back right here for a second. Because I don't want, I don't, it's a little fuzzy here. So, we're going we're gonna to go back on the screen right here. Should we win these games? I think so. I think if we could win these three games right here, we make it go nine wins. We, we really make it go nine wins. But it's not up to me. I want to hear from you guys. Do you think those are the three games that's really going to determine our season this year? Write in the comment section below. And also, man, are you excited about the season? Let's talk about it. If you love what you see or hear, man, go down here, man. You know what I'm saying? Watch more videos than I do. But once again, it's the entertainment, motivated, educated. And please don't forget all three. Lucky Murray back with another Gamecock News update. Today we're talking about the the gauntlet that we need to have in order to win the SEC East or at least be competitive in there. Three teams, Missouri, Kentucky, and Tennessee. Let me know what you think about that in the comment section below. But like always, until next time, people.